part two of Levi Davis, Surviving Holly Weird. So this man was a pro athlete, played rugby, and ended up on Celebrity X Factor. After making friends and connections and doing a couple of favors, they asked him, do you want to go higher? Lodge, but he didn't know what he was getting himself up to. He disappeared almost right after he made this video. Part two. People that you do not know, people that get into your lives through whatever means possible. In Australia, I had many, many a good memory. Because after I was hooked on drugs, and after I believe what I believe to be, I have been filmed on the dark web. And videos of me in compromising positions uh, 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 uh. and the blackmail that followed. It's true. Followed me. And he does sports, so you don't he, he don't do drugs. After that, I came back because I realized that the only way through this was by understanding the full picture myself. Damn. This was then followed after I went back to one of these people to conform to their demands. We got no choice. It's fucked up. I was told by them in ways in which are not their direct, uh -huh. but are absolutely true that they were going to attempt if I said anything else they were going to attempt to kill me threaten my family and they also were trying to frame me and oh they do all that this was followed by many attempts of gaslighting threats and I've had enough so I'm here to appeal to you to share this. The information that I gave to the police went directly back to these individuals. And I understand that the police are good people. What? Man, stop. Stop, it's Michelle. full of good people trying to do their job. Until they get corrupted. But there is also a fact that there is a large amount of police corruption and the only way that these people would have had access to my private interviews with the police is through it being leaked they also to my knowledge had access to my medical records 